yes, I've worked with an orchestra 30 years ago at the uh, London Festival Hall, and it was uh, it went down incredibly well. And since that moment, I'd always wanted to tour with orchestra, but it cost a fortune, as Rick Wakeman found out one time. Um, but the idea of uh, working with an orchestra is just so logical for this band, you know. Yes, music is a, a style of its own. It's got longer form pieces of music that were actually uh, created with orchestra in, in mind, and that's why in the early days we had Rick Wakeman playing 20 keyboards with all different sounds like orchestra strings, violins, cellos, woodwind, brass sections. And, you know, we'd go on stage and hopefully try to sound like a big orchestra. Um, but when you've got the real deal, well, why not try it? So we decided a year ago, let's make an album with an orchestra. Uh, and the main thing about doing that would be to get a really good arranger. And we did. We had Larry Grupe, who uh, worked on uh, the songs that we already wrote. And he did some beautiful arrangements. And there we were making an album called Magnification with an orchestra. And the next step to that for me was, well, why don't we do a tour with the orchestra and do orchestrations of some of the classic Yes stuff, like And You and I and Close to the Edge, and then eventually Gates of Delirium and Ritual. And this is basically what the movie, uh, the DVD, is all about. It's, it's, it's capturing the the history of yes on that symphonic level uh, for all eternity but the DVD the high definition is a step in the right direction and I really think that we've done uh, a project that's really what the yes has always been about is, is just pushing that envelope a bit and we do it because we love music and we love the adventure of being a band. And we love Yes music. 